Hey everybody, it's Jugger, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Cryostasis. Alright, now. Ooh. Weapon! Yoink. I don't have a whole lot of bullets for that. So, I'm going to switch over to you. And fall down a hole. Apparently. Why are we even on this ship? I mean, I can kind of see why he hasn't gotten off yet, because he kind of fell into a ravine or whatever. So that's why he was stuck on the ship, but did it ever say why we got on the ship in the first place? And even though he fell down said ravine, I guess, uh, it's never really shown why he can't just find another place and climb down and run away. Because if I remember correctly, his dogs aren't dead. So... Yeah, I'm not 100% sure there. Alright. Let's head out. More heat. Um, Alright. Where are you taking me? Come on, game. Give me some direction. Nope, can't fit under there. It's obvious that I need to go through that window door thing. Um, how about under here? Nope. Ah, maybe I'm wrong. But somehow I don't think so. No? Okay. Well, that's dumb. That is. It's dumb right there. Ah, oh, well. What's that sound? really wish it would stop turning off my flashlight after doing things like that. Uh-oh. I also wish that it would stop having things appear out of thin air right in front of me. Because that's not even fair. Oh, that, that, this is going to end well. I can tell. This beard is not actually really hot. Um, oh god. That's right. You just stay there. Are you dead? Now you are! Just so you know, game, if you want to do stuff like that, I'm totally fine with it. Just... Uh-oh. Not you guys again. Come on. Do it. Frame rate. And it turned my flashlight off again. Now that I'm starting to... Notice it, it's gotten really annoying. Um, let's see how to open a door. Oh, here it is. 
And now a monster jumps out. Okay, maybe not. You know, I should really stop doing that because apparently I'm not very good at predicting this stuff. Hey, it's another page of the weird story. Oh, wait, it's no. It's been two weeks, and the ship is dead in the water. Why won't this iceberg let us go? These thoughts have haunted me it? during the long nights as I listen to the mournful sounds of the glacier. Nothing exhausts the mind quite so much as dark thoughts. I don't think that glaciers and, and so icebergs I was are the exhausted, same thing. But I finally understood. We had all stayed in our cabins. No one came out to greet it. We were all convinced we were going to get through. We disrespected it. We had no fear. And so the thin layer of our human knowledge cracked under the weight of nature. I have to tell you, I don't think that the iceberg cared that you... What was it? Disregarded it? I think it said? I think that it was more of a, ah, oh, we can make it crash kind of thing. Which really says a whole lot about your captain and crew. Because I know that it's going to happen. Okay. Come on, here we go. Maybe at the top. Oh, what? It's open? That's weird. Huh. Auto save. Okay. Left or right? Left. Uh oh. Oh god. Die, you. Yep, like I said, right. Definitely right. out of ammo for this, so... Switching back to the Tommy gun. And... Oh, there it is. Alright. Oh, God. Where the... See what I mean? I totally checked this spot. The fact that they can just pop out of nowhere is kind of dumb and annoying. Although, you know, monster closets are nothing new. Can I? Nope. Alright. What's the plan? Alright, get over to there. Oh god. Hey, it's fish! That's a great sign. You know, they kind of made it very clear throughout the game that the problem is that the ship is taking on water. So, why exactly did it not sink? What the? Huh. I thought I heard a fish. Wait. Where do I go now? Oh. It's an electrical panel. Okay. Or just go through the door. That works too. Ooh, I'm dying. I need some heat. Heat? 
Anywhere? No? Okay. Whoa! Your axe is no match for my gun. Crap, it's fluorescent! It's like when they made this ship, they didn't plan on someone having to use heat to survive. Although sometimes it seems like they did! For instance, the incredibly hot valves everywhere. would kind of make the engineering department pissed off, I would think. Oh god, the only reason that they give me a whole lot of ammo is because I'm going to need it. Alright. Let's get this boss right over with. Alright, hold on, hold on, reloading, reloading. See, wouldn't it be a lot nicer if I could just steal his things? Alright, let's see how you die. To the anchor room. I'll drain the water. Uh, sure. I was just standing over here, uh, against a wall, but I suppose I can go to the anchor room. Whoa. I'm going! Jesus! Where have you been? We need to cast both anchors simultaneously! Get to the other winch and wait for my command! Ready? Go! Turn! Oh no! You crazy bastard! You killed us all! But how did he die? How did he end up here if he died? I don't know. I've stopped caring. Well, that'll just about do it for this episode of Let's Play Cryostasis. So I've once again been Jugger, and I will see you guys next time.